hey guys welcome back this is pixel frank and today we are going to be doing a pretty unorthodox video today's video is going to be about star wars the old republic and in it we are going to open up a hundred a hundred ultimate cartel packs now these 100 ultimate cartel packs were gifted by a mysterious benefactor who shall not be named but he is a dear friend of mine and i thank him for it um this was huge um we just went on to to play a couple of uh flashpoints in uh star wars the other Party, and he was like look i got a gift and i want to give you this and uh he sent me these and i was like dude are you sure and uh one of his uh one of his criteria were, was that okay you should make a video about this and open all 100 of them uh on the video so today that's what we are going to do so let's uh start doing it because uh oh my god 100 i don't even know if i have enough um space in my inventory to to do so but uh let's uh let's do it um worst case scenario we are going to go to the legacy cargo hold and we are going to uh pretty much just store everything there so all right Whew. first card pack now one thing that is bothering my ocds right now is that i cannot stack a hundred but anyway let's start out and let's see where this takes us first thing first all right all right all right all right open one pack never show again all right, this is Karelian Bunker Buster Bash, Travel Records, Stronghold Defenders Blaster Rifle. This is uh, okay, Hero YH 55 and uh, Signet Ring of Ancient. Okay, Cultural Artifact. All right, I see. I think we are going to reveal all all of them uh, uh, the upcoming ones or we are going to reveal all of them at once so that's what we are going to be doing all right that was the first one but did i okay imperial reapers armor set all right nice this is the first armor set we got this is great um but where does this put it item item stash maybe oh no okay oh actually yeah that that's a good idea if we store those there but where do um just give me a second how do i how do I, uh, weapon, armor, Imperial Reapers, armor, so, oh, so everything is going to, to, to be stored here. I see now. I see now. All right. This, this, this makes sense. Okay. So that was pack number two. Let's open another one. Shall we? All right. Glowing eyes. Casual Combatant Armor. Band Hollowids. Ooh. I wonder what these are. And Forge Conduit. All right, next pack. Let's go. This is the fourth pack. Pack number four yields us... Zakulan Inquisitor's Armor Set. We have Coil Explorer's Armor Set. So two armor sets and... Uh, and a bunch of other stuff. Okay. We got like three to four armor sets right now. Ooh. All right. That's a gold one. And the bronze Serenity's unsealed lightsaber. Oh, nice. Uh, that This is pack number six. Let's see. Antique. Sakura Saber Staff and Orlean Patriot. So two bronze, one silver. Another oh commander's assault cannon. Alright. Uh, 
All right, this, this is this is getting more and more excited. Uh, as I read the rules, the more you open, the higher the chance for you to get something platinum. Is this is this silver? I think this is silver. This isn't the platinum one. It's not as glowy. Okay. Oh wow. All right, three bronze, four bronze items. That's actually not bad. Here are cards and customization. All right. Saberist body armor. Theron Cedric customization. Emote not off. All right, we have a, two silvers, one bronze. All right, it's a cool mini. Oh, then we have Mantellian Frontline Dual Saber. This is this looks pretty cool. Although I'm not that fan of the black orange uh, crystals. I I'm I'm the 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 good old. Uh, Standard lightsaber fan, you know. Emote romance shuffle, okay. Now oh, I can romance shuffle. Well, would you look at that? I mystic hazel indestructible crystal. I like the color of that. Imperial hotball home uniform. Ooh, that could be great to to play hotballs in, uh, in those outfits. That's kind of cool. I haven't been uh, playing uh, hotball for a while. PvP stuff. Advanced Lime Green Hawkeye. I like the color of that, that's for sure. Alright, we already opened 15, I think. Ooh, Noble Consular's Armor Set. I think I like that. That is, that is something I would wear on a Sith. Able Hunter Armor Set. Well, that would be great for uh, a bounty hunter, maybe. Uh, Alright, would you look at that? Advanced blue-gray Hawkeye crystal. I like the color. Advanced pink-purple war heroes crystal. And elegant loungewear armor set. Ooh. <laughs> Not bad. Shackled crystal scones. Okay. All right, let's see. Let's see. Vintage load lifter. I think I like that. This too. All right. We're closing in on 20 boxes opened. Nice, gold mount. Desert Scavenger's armor set. Ooh, I like that. Oh, that looks like the sand, sand people's armor. That is very close to it. Oh, I really like that. Leveling on Tatooine with this armor set. Ooh, that would be great. Tatooine and Hoth. The two extremes are my favorite uh, maps so far in Star Wars. <clears throat> of course, if I want uh, a city planet, Narshada is the one to go for. Of course, Kant is like, eh. But so far, so good. We have a lot of silvers, that's for sure. Advanced Silver Blue Hawkeye Crystal. I like the look of that. Not gonna lie. Advanced White Purple Hawkeye Crystal. And then we have Gloomlight Vrag. I mean, it's a gold mount, but it doesn't feel any special to me, at least. Now, this is something I, I like more. And it's not even a gold mount. It's something that I just like. 
faint emote. Okay. Ooh, what is this? Forward ops chest plate. Oh, it's just a chest plate? Alright. Vision Defender's armor set. Not bad, not bad. Wow, I like this. Hero's banner. What's it? Advanced Fallen Red Indestructible Crystal. Not bad. Overloaded Interrogator Armor Set. I like the look of that. Old Statesman Armor Set. Mm, not bad. I mean, for a bronze, I think it's pretty cool. For role-playing purposes, you can always use different armor sets, right? Blood Red Hawkeye Crystal. I could see that working on uh, on a female uh, character. Female Jedi Consular or something. Advanced Purple Outline Eviscerating Crystal. Now, that is something I really, I really like. Imperial Hotball Away Uniform. I mean, home and away, what's the difference? Uh, not a bad mount, but... Sure. Wow, what is this? Darth Malgus Lightsaber. I think this is the first... I think this is... These are the Platinums. Damaged? Okay. I think this is the first Platinum we see in... Uh, 33 packs. All right, that's a third out of the packs. One in 33. Ooh. I think that was the first platinum, right? We had a couple of golds. And, uh, yeah. All right, this the Mercenary Slicer's armor set, not bad. Ooh, Shadow Corsair's armor set. I mean, I don't like uh, the eye, those eye patches, but sure. Black and the deep pink. All right. Ooh, advanced yellow core indestructible crystal. I like that. A white, white lightsaber with uh, with yellow uh, outline. Ooh, that's that's really cool. Still of the lost master. Okay. And, uh, yeah, all right, all right. Ooh, I like the look of this mount. These are the, the good old mounts that we, we started the game out with, if you guys remember. Everyone that, that played at the beginning, they got, uh, like, a gray, something like this, but in a, in a, in a white. In a white for those that uh, bought the deluxe edition back when the game released. I mean, that was, like, years ago, like, 11 years ago something like that 10 10 years i think yeah what is this flare obsidian squad hmm. not bad not bad another gold minas wasp doesn't look bad the stronghold able chamber of deception all right well we should live live up to that name to make uh, our stronghold that deceptive elite regulators armor set it's just a bronze armor set but i really like the the look of it i think it all depends on uh, what you uh on what your tastes are not necessarily the rarity of it oh d5 2d astromech droid i already have one but this is another color that's that's cool and this blaster rifle doesn't look that bad either Let's see, um, not really a fan of these. And everything's bronze here, so... Alright, next one. Ooh. Sahar Katin's lightsaber. That doesn't look bad. Ooh, but the Demolisher's helmet. Nice! This looks really cool. Regal Chamilizard. Okay. 
I guess for role playing purposes it would work. And then Nahut's heavy sniper rifle. This is the second. This is the second platinum or whatever this is. Advanced derelict purple destructible lightsaber. This is this is what 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 I really enjoy. Just I would really enjoy it if it would just be plain purple, but. I guess that is cool too and this one too because i mean this the only reason why i really like this is because it feels like it's it's a double bladed or or it's a lightsaber that has two blades to it you know advanced magenta outline eviscerating crystal nice and what is this a silver high roller gray and gold dye module all right next one here we go Advanced Black Pink Hawkeye and Nomad's Armor Set. Next. Another. Th this is the third platinum we got. Overtuned der Derelict Lightsaber. Now, this is something that I really like. It's so simple, it looks really cool. Hmm, nice. Opulent aristocrat. <laughs> uh, that would work for a uh, for a smuggler, right? Uh, that's cool. Oh, and the smuggler blaster pistol as well that goes with it. Nice. So we are over fifty now. Not bad. Vine cat uh, handler license. What does this mean? Is this a... Uh... I don't know. What is this? Um... Quest creature handler vine. Okay. Advanced blood red eviscerating crystal. Ooh. Deep red and dark purple. I, I wonder what that looks like. The cool mini probe. Well, that could be a cool minion. Not bad, not bad. Oh my god. This is a deep pink and black dye. I think uh, we already got uh, a black and deep pink. The, I mean, the reverse one. Alright, that's interesting. Let's see. I think I already have this set, but... Yeah. Nice. Let's move out. Outer Rim Explorer, out of breath. Then we have Fleet Commander Die Module, which is... Okay, nice. Ooh, Advanced Ocean Blue War Heroes Crystal. That is really cool. I like the color of that. And what is this? Imperial E1 Enforcer Lightsaber. Imperial E1 Enforcer. Okay, alright. Every time I look at uh, at an item, I feel like... I, I, I think, how could I use this for my, uh, for my role-playing, right? I really like creating characters and just role-playing with them, you know? Although I do all of that uh, off uh, off stream or off camera. Uh, actually, a, go a good question. Would you guys uh, enjoy uh, uh, role-playing themed walkthroughs or playthroughs of the game? Let me know in the comment section down below. Let's see if we, if we should do some uh, Star Wars The Old Republic content. And I think this is the fourth or the fifth platinum we get. Uh, the Oriconian Sis. That is a mount. So far we've gotten only weapons. If I'm not mistaken. I'm going to have to watch back the recording. But Savage Falone. Another mount. Nice. We got a Starforge Blaster Rifle. Alright, let's go. Oh boy. That was an underwhelming one, but uh, yeah. Oh, I really dig this one. 
Long's first step in mystery. Yeah, these were the one, but uh, the ones you got in the deluxe edition of the game were white. Were like very royally white. <clears throat> Not bad. Uh, Rose armor set, daring Rose. What is this? Sign of Havoc. Nice. Havoc squad ready for duty. Fearless Retaliator's lightsaber. That, that looks kind of cool for a bronze uh, lightsaber, if I can say so myself. Let's see. Ceremonial guard armor set. Ooh. Not bad. Massage bot? Calling the massage bot to assist you in your recovery? <laughs> oh, this is a great one. How comes this is a bronze? I would expect it to be a gold. That's funny, man. That's so funny. Uh, ooh, that's a good looking blaster pistol. I like the blade under it. Oof. Nice. <clears throat> oh, we already got one of these, and I, I really dig, uh, dig that. I, I really like it. That's really cool. Let's see. Uh, next, next. We have the Jory Dar Daragon's armor set. Jorai. That looks... That looks cool. It looks very, uh, you know... Very Egyptian, but it looks cool. Now let let's see what did we get now? Icas Falchion. I like these uh this pointy blade looking uh I don't know. Looks like they, they are blades, but Yeah. What is this? Plasma core assault cannon. Nice. Then we have another gold. Imperial E1 Enforcer bla Blaster. I think we already got the lightsaber, right? The Imperial E1 Enforcer uh, lightsaber. Gale Cutter. Ah. Lots of mounts. Lots of mounts that we get. Target Dummy. Then we have Blaster Rifle and Firestorm Blaster. That looks simple, but effective. And then we have something advanced red black war heroes crystal which looks kind of cool nice i think we already have one of those Turret simulator and then pitiless raider lightsaber. Okay. Mountain lizard. Cartel market certificate. Can can be traded to underworld exchange reputation vendors for specialty goods. Underworld exchange vendors can be found in the cartel bazaar on the fleet. I don't know I don't exactly know what this is, but we are going to have to check that out. Oh, this looks, uh, this looks thick. This looks like a thick lightsaber. Advanced pink core Hawkeye crystal. Blaster, but DT-11 blaster pistol. Small, but effective. Flatland Zeldrate. Nice. And then we have the Prophet Starforge lightsaber. That lightsaber for a bronze one looks really cool. And very detailed indeed. Wow. That looks really cool. Now we are pretty much over with 75 and we still have 25 boxes to go. Wow, this has been this has been a journey so far. We got so many things out of this one. Five platinum items uh, in total so far. Covered, covered ciphers armor set. I like uh, the look of that. That looks very old school Star Wars, right? Well, with this probe. 
next to it. That looks very old school Star Wars. <laughs> Kira Carson customization 10. We already got that, if I'm not mistaken. I've seen that before, that's for sure. Savage Nexu. Morning Raptor. Okay. What is this? Wayward Verger's armor set. And Mandalore, the Preserver's armor set. Not bad. <clears throat> Ooh, dueling banner. I like the look of that banner. Dark Eternal Throne decoration. I like that uh, model class. Starship bundle. Hmm. Cool looking talent cutter. I like that uh, mount. Looks really cool. I think we already got uh, one of those, but in another color. Trailblazer's armor. That looks. Ooh, that looks very detailed. I really like that. Then we have a uh, vintage load lifter. Mm hmm. Ooh, teal black Hawkeye crystal. That looks really cool for a silver uh, crystal. Wow. Uh -huh, I really like that. Right. Let's see. Let's see anything that would stand out. Planetary Hollow map. Gold decoration. All right. Cure cards and customization ten. A uh, third time. What emote sweep? <laughs> How is that a bronze emote? Oh, uh, I expect it to be at least silver. M4B Arrowhead. I like the look of that. Ventilated Skellin armor set. Ventilated. I mean, that is pretty ventilated. It's more, it's more uh, naked than an armor. But, oh, we already have one of those. So, okay. Bigger score, Blaster Dorn. Hmm. Wow. Are you kidding me? Oh, I thought... I thought it was a mount for a second. Ooh. For a second, I thought it was a mount, boys. You have to be kidding me. Wow, what the hell? A Stinger Ele Electro Staff? Man, that would be great to play with... Uh, with uh, um, playing like an an ancient uh, uh, Sith Assassin or something. A Stinger Electro Staff? That would be so cool. Like, we're role-playing as a... Uh, as a, a, a Sith guard, right? Playing a Sith assassin. Oh, that would be huge. Commemorative statue of R Raven. Eh. 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 Blastek T189S. <laughs> credit flip. Flip a credit, you regenerate health. I like the look of that. Rev Rev Revelers armor? Or Revelers? I don't know how you spell that, but sure. Mystic Hazel. I think we already got one of those, but I'm I'm kinda happy that we that now we have two. Alright, six to go. Title freelancer. That was before. Ruthless Oppressor's Armor Set, Revenite Planning Tent, and Unburdened Champion Armor Set. I really like the look of this, but this, Ruthless Oppressor's Armor Set, oh wow. And the detailing, I just hope that the amount of detail that is on this thumbnail is the amount of detail you get when you put on the armor set, to be honest. I just hope for that. Advanced copper indestructible crystal. I really dig this copper, uh, this copper uh, color. I actually think I'm going to put it on uh, my current uh, character that we are playing with right now. 
Altar of Souls. Let's see. VL 10 SD rifle. Honestly, for a bronze rifle, that looks really cool. There are a lot of bronze items that look way better than others that that are gold or or like platinum to be honest. <clears throat> Adept scout armor set like this. This for example, nah. Nah, it, it, it isn't gold value. But I saw other uh, a bronze bronze armor sets for for smugglers that that pretty much outdid this one. All right, then we have uh, Cobalt Dura Steel. What is that? Place a selected unlock to your player character. But what is that? Oh, it's an emote. I see. A mood. Okay, it, it said emote. I just wasn't reading it. All right, the last two. Let's see. Come on. Ooh, the last two packs. The last 10 items that we get. Let's see. The first one. Wasbeck Giska. Statue of a Warrior's Call. Security Soldier's Armor Set. Wow, this looks cool for an uh, for an Imperial Agent. All right. Energy Blade Bayonet and the Rare Munitions. All right, let's see. Let's see. The last pack. The last pack, boys. Out of 100 that I got gifted. Oh, come on. Oof. Drum rolls. First thing first the dark brown and the medium brown dime module that could work very well for a jedi robe nice then reputable business references nice uh i, I don't know what is it with hollow sign outer worm stew huh? the last two items celebration pen and the last item Come on, something. Hollow sign bar blue. I mean, a bit of an anticlimactic ending, but all in all, a hundred packs did we open. And in total, we got 500 items. Wow. Holy amoly. And uh, a lot of those were duplicates. Because they stack together, as from from what I can see, adept scout armors we got two out of. Can we sort by quantity? Yeah, let's sort by quantity. Let's see what did we get a lot of duplicates, duplicates or triplicates out of. Let's see, adept scout, some companion gifts. We have black pink hawkeye two out of, advanced blood red die packs, weapon misc. Authentic identification codes. I don't know what that is. This grants a large amount of reputation points. Now, oh, okay. Now, now we know. Um, another another one for our reputation. Sure. Then we have uh, two long spurs, major exploration experience boosts, Merim. Two of these. Let's see. Patient Defender's Armor Set, we got two out of. That makes sense. We got two security, uh, security Soldier's Armor Set two times. All right. Did not pay attention to that, but uh, I, I saw this two times. Yeah, this as well. And then we only have uh, the simple ones. And we got a lot of crystals. A lot of crystals, and I'm very happy to have that. Well, all in all, I would like to thank you, uh, my dear friend, for sending me a hundred packs. Holy moly, this this um, this must have cost you a lot of money. I wouldn't even start thinking about it. Thinking about it. So thank you for gifting a uh, hundred packs. Uh, I w I'm sure uh, that I will have to uh, reciprocate this gesture. And uh, yeah. And for you guys out there, thank you guys for tuning in. This was pretty much a hundred cartel packs opened uh, in a sitting. Wow. So yeah, let me know your thoughts, guys. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section down below as uh, uh, what did you expect to get out of a hundred packs? What, what, what would you have liked to pop up in these uh, 100 packs and didn't pop up? 
and so on and so forth uh, all in all if i put it by uh cartel rarity so we got at uh one two a three four five and six in total six platinum items and a lot of gold items that's for sure so gold we had a a lot of but platinums only six i mean of course i say only six but i don't even know what uh what the the chance uh for these are to drop uh let me know if you if you found uh, more platinums in uh in 100 boxes or uh, or whatever how many uh boxes uh, you opened how often uh, did you come across platinums or golds and yeah guys i'm going to see you next time and uh stay safe uh, be well, Merry Christmas, and Happy Winter Holidays. This has been a Pixel Frank. If you like the video, you know what to do. Comment, like, subscribe. Uh, become a part of our small but growing community. Thank you guys for tuning in. Bye-bye.